boom. Did you know that you and your family could have a free vacation every year down here in Florida? Hi, I'm Marco Terminesi, Florida's Canadian real estate agent. And my passion is helping fellow Canadians like you find the vacation home of your dreams in Florida without any stress at all. And today, we're going to address a question that I get at least five times a week from Northern buyers. Marco, can I buy a place in Florida then I could bring my family for vacation once a year, but also rent out for the rest of the year when I'm not there, maybe even through Airbnb? What a great question and one that not a lot of people know about. And the answer is yes, you can do it. You and your family can have an amazing vacation down here in Florida every year for free all while having a property that pays for itself when you're not here. Super simple. Not to mention all the appreciation you'll make on the property over the years. Cha -ching! Although it's possible, you need to be sure you do this right. You have to be very careful where you purchase and what you purchase to ensure this strategy will 100% work. That is why you need a great realtor. Once you decide on a condo or a house, you need to be very informed about the rules and regulations of what you are buying. For instance, many condos have rental restrictions in their bylaws stating either you need to wait two years before you can rent it out or that there is only one lease per year allowed in the building. With these tight rental restrictions, these are not the best places to implement this strategy. On the other hand, you have condos that allow three, four, six, or even 12 leases per year, which makes this strategy very doable and powerful. Even better, there are a couple of hidden gem condos that even have a management and hotel system built right into the property. They actually manage and rent your unit out for you when you're not down here, for a fee of course, but how cool and easy. This allows you to just flip a switch when you want to rent it. Here's an example and a brand new construction condo on Singer Island in West Palm Beach called Amrit. You can purchase a nice new condo and use it for a couple weeks or so, then rent it out the rest of the year. I have the detailed data on this for you, but for easy translation, the rent you will collect for the remainder of the year will equate to your full property taxes and a full year of condo fees. Sometimes, if you let it be rented in our winter months, what we call in season, you will actually turn a larger profit annually. What a deal. When it comes to houses, you also need to be careful because you don't want to buy into a community where the rules and regulations don't allow this strategy. With that being said, there are many hidden gem communities with no homeowners association and no community bylaws. This then gives you the ability to rent as many times as you want. This is where I am personally seeing the Airbnbs becoming very successful. For instance, I just sold a home in a no homeowners association community for 500,000 and they put 100,000 in renovations and furniture to make it seaside vibe. If you didn't want to renovate, no worries. You can buy them already all fixed up. This one grosses the seller 50,000, net 38,000, which is about 6.3% ROI a year. And they use it for three weeks with their own family. It's easy to manage, makes money, and provides them a free three week vacation every year. The rental market here is on fire. So many intelligent investors have recently discovered this strategy and they're enjoying their annual family vacations here in Florida 100% free. If you have more questions, please leave me a comment below and I'll personally respond. And as always, call me, text me, email me, FaceTime me, and I'll be happy to help you through the entire process. If you thought this video provided useful and helpful information, please slap that like button, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you can get notified every time I launch a new video. Make it a great day and I look forward to seeing you down here soon. But also rent out the rest of the year when I'm not there. Maybe even through Airbnb. You put 100,000 in renovations and furniture to make it a seaside vibe. If you don't... <laughs> to make it a seaside vibe. If you don't want to renovate, no worries.
furniture to make it a coastal vibe. <laughs> no, let's just stick to seaside vibe. <laughs> let's stick to what you purchase to ensure this strategy will 100% 100% work. That is why you need a great realtor. <laughs> right? Yeah. I got this one. <laughs>